Hey, how you feeling, Jose, after the long layoff? It feels good to be back, man, especially in my hometown here in the Central Valley, Fresno. You know, you saw the, the atmosphere, it was, it was second to none, man. And I really enjoyed myself in that ring, you know, it was a Bridget Conley came to fight, man. Uh, you know, the first couple rounds, I landed some great water shots, man, and he kept coming forward. And I know those water shots, once, you, once I land a good one, but the body shot never goes away. It, it kind of stays in your body, you know. So I just knew, I just knew if I kept on touching them, touching them, touching them, uh, you know, I was gonna be very successful. But I just kind of went back to being my old self, you know, and staying active. And you guys noticed my last couple fights, I was winning a little too much, trying to box, you know. But I had to go back and be, you know, just be myself, you know, and be that warrior that, that's very active through through rounds and throw a lot of punches and I think that was very successful on my behalf. You know, you came out aggressive in the first round. Was that the plan, you know, to try to knock him out early or, no, or was brother, that just you getting back to just, you? Just be getting back to myself. If the plan wasn't to, you know, score a first round knock, I know it just, it, this, this kind of fight reminded, reminded me of myself when I fought in front of the Roscoe. You know, he kind of came forward and all of a sudden my hand just started, you know, floating. And I realized that, you know, that he was, uh, kind of loading up on his punch a little bit, so I started working that body, you know, and kind of punching, kind of punching the body, and, and it worked out, you know, and and I just, you know, kept going, and as the fight went on, you know, I just wanted to be a little smarter, make sure, you know, again, it's, it's been a, a, a year since I've been in that ring, so, although sparring was great, you know, you still, it's still different when you're in there in that ring, you know, it's, it's with Aeon's gloves, I mean, you feel everything. What's next? Uh, any champion, brother, hopefully, are willing, you know, um, I think I'm in, a, I'm in a great position where, you know, I want to face either, you know, the, the winner Josh Taylor, Teofimo Lopez, or uh, or go after the WBC belt. Well, the plan to stay at 140? Go uh, 147? Yeah, 100% 147. I think, you know, I think this was a, a, a good test right now to tell myself where I'm at at 140, you know, because I'm getting bigger, man. And believe it or not, it, it's not easy making 140 anymore, but I think there's... You know, there's just two fights that I have in mind. There's two fights that I think people want to watch, and that's me and Regis, and me and the winner, Josh, Josh Chen and Chippy Malone. So I think uh, those two fights are something that I want to do before, before I move to 147. Are you going to call Bob or ex Bob to try to make the fight? Most well, definitely, you know, man, and that's, you know, you know 100%. You know, I, I think, you know, we both deserve uh, a, fair ch a fair share when it comes to, you know, because. A percentage could, a percentage could, you know, it means something, but there's a number behind that percentage, and that's what it really means. And you know, I, you know, they, they need, they need to treat me like, you know, I need, I need to get compensated the way I've been comp getting compensated with, even with Pedrosa and and uh, you know, the Hooker and Taylor, those guys. But man, at this point, I just want to fight, man. I just want to fight. You know, I enough enough about business. People don't want to hear that no more. You know, just they're just sitting down and making the fight. You know, making the fight happen. How is your stamina? You know, after you know, like you said, being out of the ring for a year. Uh, man, I I, I stayed pretty active touching them. You know, so um, you know, I guess it was it was it was it was good. Um, you know, it's it's always the again going back and being that active volume puncher. Again, it was, I haven't I haven't done that since since I fought. You know, maybe Hooker. Or, or Oscar back, you know, in 1819. But uh, you know, it just—it's good to be back and, and know that, that my, my body still has uh, that in it, you know. Like, you know, and, and, and I'm just motivated to go back and, and enjoy my family and, and, and get back to work, get back to the gym as soon as possible. What made you so emotional?